It took over a billion dollars to build this masterpiece here in Dallas. And it's more than ready for this matchup between the Giants and the Cowboys. Hello friends, Jim Nance along with Bill Sims. We have two teams today who desperately want to beat one another. It has turned into one of the great rivalry matchups around the entire National Football League. And how do you see it, Phil, before kickoff? I'll just say it this way. I don't think they like each other a whole lot. So that, that always makes for more exciting football, and we're going to see how it plays out. And let's check in the latest from the sidelines. Here's Danielle Bellini. Thanks, guys. Speaking with the players from both sides, these are two teams that obviously know each other very well. They play twice a year, so they know each other. They're familiar with each other. And with that in mind, guys, both coaches preached about the importance of being unpredictable. So watch out for some surprises on that field today. Thanks, Danielle. And now we'll go to the field. Cowboys will be kicking off. He will run this one back. Oh, we've got an injured player on the field. Always hard to guess what the injury is, but and don't like to speculate, but I think it's pretty apparent. It's an upper body injury. We'll let you know when we find out. They face first down. Wilson's going to take the handoff now. Well, when you're going to run the football, if that's your objective, you cannot get frustrated by short runs. You know that it's going to build itself as the game goes along, so keep trying. Watch the blitz, watch the blitz. David Wilson lined up in the backfield. Oh, that's good enough for the first down, their first of the day. Tackle down at the 42-yard line. I think when I was playing, anytime we crossed the 50-yard line, it was kind of like a big sigh of relief because I knew now that there were a lot of things that could take place. I could afford to take sacks. I could uh, afford to be a little more aggressive. Let's see how the offense reacts to this. Danielle's got an injury update for us. Let's go to her now. Guys, I just spoke with a Cowboys official. Sounds like it's just a minor issue, and he'll be back on the field shortly. That long gain sets them up here on this play. Wilson's going to secure the handoff. They've got him behind the line of scrimmage. Good job by the defense. They stopped the offense that time on first down. Now the defense is in a good situation. After being stuffed at the line of scrimmage, it's now second down and 10. It's Wilson on the handoff, running to the left side. That's a gain of eight. When you're an offensive lineman and you can line up and just run the football straight ahead and pick up those kind of yards, you are going to get into the head of the defense. You're basically saying we're tougher than you are and we're just going to come right at you. Third and two. They'll run with it again. And he's going to be tackled and that's going to bring us to fourth down. You cannot let offensive players get up the sideline in the NFL. That's where a lot of big plays are made. The defensive end that time. Well, he was on the end and he stopped that run for very little gain. The kick is good. 
You always want to be rewarded for a nice drive in a football game, even when it's a field goal. Because you've made a lot of good plays, you've executed them, you got yourself in position to get some points, and that field goal just reinforces everything. And that return, a very unspectacular 19 yards, that's all. And here's the Cowboys quarterback out of Eastern Illinois, Tony Romo. Tony Romo has everything you want, the starting quarterback in the NFL. He has good mobility in the pocket, he has experience, and he has a terrific throwing arm, which he doesn't get enough credit for. An extra tight end on the field for this one. First and 10, Murray. Then picks up about three. Past winner of the Walter Payton Award, Jason Witten, a steady influence at tight end. I think you said the word right. It is steady. He just keeps marching along every single year. Big numbers in receptions and putting up big yards, too, when it comes to receiving yards. DeMarco Murray is in the backfield. Second down and seven. Murray's handed the football. A big chunk of yardage gained by DeMarco Murray. DeMarco Murray, just like so many running backs in the NFL, he's big, he's quick-footed, so he can bounce outside when there's nobody there, and then time he gets it done and picks up big yards. And that will close out the first quarter in Arlington, Texas. We'll be back after the break for the start of the second. The Cowboys still driving as the second quarter gets underway. DeMarco Murray is in the backfield. And the second quarter is underway with this snap. Murray fighting for big yardage. DeMarco Murray from the University of Oklahoma. He was a standout Sooner, and he is a standout Cowboy. This guy can flat out get it done. Harris is a receiver in the slot. First down and 10. Dells Bryant with the catch. Nice job by the quarterback finding the open guy short. They get the completion. They still do not get the first down though. Murray's lined up now as the running back behind the quarterback. We've hit the two-minute warning here in the first half. Tony Romo will take it right from the center. 
Second and short. DeMarco Murray gets the handoff. He'll be brought down, but not before picking up the first down. Jim, they got momentum on their side right now. They are making everything work. That was a nice play. They pick up another first down, and they got a good drive going here. They're able to move the chains after that last run. Halfway through the second, and here's the snap. Nice run that time. When you run the football like this, over a period of time, it's going to wear that defense out. There's no doubt about it. Nice job by the offensive line. Bryant's in the slot. It's a second and four. Working that left side. Incomplete as that ball sails out of bounds. The Cowboys have to get to the 25 to move the chains. Witten's a tight end, but now shifted into the backfield. Third and four. Looking to the right side and throwing. Makes the catch in the open field. Good job by the offense. Getting another first down. You can tell by looking down on the field that defense hands on their knees they are getting tired the cowboys are going to burn the first of their three timeouts right here the offense looking down the field the promised land so close by let's see what they do on first down following that huge play no margin for error from just outside the goal line. That ball is picked off. They pounce on him there. That's a touchback, and the ball will be spotted at the 20. This defensive coordinator, he is one aggressive dude. He keeps going after this offense, and finally he gets the interception inside uh, their own 20-yard line and stops the offense from getting any points. Cowboys come out in a dime package. Now first and ten. Looking at every option. Terrible throw by the quarterback. Terrible route by the wide receiver. Oh, wow, what a shock. The football was incomplete. Failing to complete that one. So, second down here. He has the grab. Gains about three. The Giants signal for a timeout. They have two remaining. Offense still looking for a first after that completion on second down. Brown's got it on the handoff. The tackle's going to be made, but he's beyond the first down marker. Well, when you try to tackle this guy, his legs are the size of a refrigerator, so hard to wrap him up. That's why he picked up the big game. New set of downs now after picking up the first on the ground. Manning 
Jones going to take the snap from the shotgun. Throwing now to his left. Going to lose yards here. So that's going to do it for the first half. Giants are up in this one, which is brought to you by Verizon. this one where the Giants lead by three. Let's check in on the sidelines. Danielle Bellini is there. Guys, I spoke with Coach Coughlin during halftime. Not much scoring here, so obviously Coach talked about wanting to move the ball specifically through the air. He feels like there are opportunities for big plays on the field, so he just wants to see his guys take advantage of them. Back to you. Danielle, thank you very much. Now we'll go to the field. Away from the ball, there's a flag down on the field. Personal foul, Clippin, receiving team. Always one of the more dangerous moments out on the field when you see a flag thrown for Clipping. Yeah, it is, Jim. The player you are blocking or clipping can't protect himself. And when you go down low on those legs and do that, it's a dangerous play. It's definitely worthy of the call. First and ten. Romo's got the football after the play fake. Well, when your team is behind, what do you do? Just come out there and get a first down. That's a nice job by the offense. Tony Romo will take it right from the center. First and ten. They'll go ground. Here comes the training staff as we've got a player down on the field. That's a good job. He's able to get up and get off the field. And my guess is he's going to be okay. A little bit of a scare there, no doubt about it. That makes everybody nervous. It's now second down. And the give now to DeMarco Murray. There's the tackle, but still, it's enough for the first down. Nice job that time by the ball carrier. Get it just past the first down mark. Big first down. Keep the chains moving. Harris lined up in the slot. First down and 10. Back to the ground. He's going to the left. And they advance the ball onto the other side of the field. Second down following the run. to him again the tackle was made but the first down is picked up nothing fancy about that but it's a good run gets a first down now the offense has three more chances Harris is going to get set in the slot for this snap. Now first and ten. Challenging the defenders to the right side. That tackle made by Pierre Paul. Well, when you get a couple first downs, it just gives you such great confidence. It makes everybody relax. And I always say this, when you're a relaxed athlete, that's when you play your best.
They've got a first down now after that catch. To the ground here. A tackle behind the line. We've got to give the defense some credit. On first down, there's so many things the offense can do. They were ready for that play, and they stopped it. Witten's playing out of position in the backfield here. Romo's going to take it from the gun. Easy catch in the promised land. Touchdown. How about this gift? A wide open receiver down the field. The quarterback, good job of finding. He throws it down there and he gets the easy touchdown. The Cowboys for the point after. And the extra point is good. The Giants looking for a big return and hoping to find a way to regain the lead. Scores 7-3. to three. And he'll start his return. Spins away from the hit. First down on the way. Wilson's taking the handoff. He steps out. When you run off tackle, one of the things you're looking for is for your tackle to make a good block. And then if you have a lead fullback, can he get past him and block the linebacker to free up the halfback so he can go in between them and get in the secondary and make a big play. Second and short following the run. Fifteen minutes to go. You're watching the NFL on EA Sports. Not a whole lot of scoring here as we welcome you back to the action. Time is running out here in the fourth, and the defense is trying to preserve this win. Final quarter underway now with this snap. Has the catch, but the feet are not down. Ah, the defense got away with one that time. It wasn't a good play in their part. It was just bad timing by the quarterback and receiver. These guys need to make something happen on offense with time beginning to run out. Third and one. David Wilson gets the handoff. Now they take the football onto the opponent's side of the field. After that long run, that running back deserves a break. Go over to the sideline, let a few guys pat you on the rear end and tell you how good you are and then get a little oxygen and get back in the game. What a run. First and ten. Going across the middle. That picks up seven. There has been good pass protection for the quarterback all day long. He has not been sacked much, and he throws it there and gets another completion. And Myers is in the slot here for this play. Second down, four to go. He'll fire it out to the left. That pass incomplete.
Wilson's lined up as the single back. Third down and four. Looking for a receiver on the left side here. This offense can't be stopped on third down no matter the distance. You know, when you throw the football like that down the field, you pick up a first down, now you can do anything you want on the offensive side, and you've got that defense guessing. Just about two minutes to go, and the defense knows it needs to make one last stop to end it. And they sack the quarterback. Snickers is the proud sponsor of this satisfying defensive replay. When hunger hits, Snickers satisfies. The throw to the left. Great pass. Great catch. Great control. Well, that's a nice completion by the offense. And what it does, it just puts them in a more manageable situation so they can pick up that third down. That play will be challenged by the booth upstairs inside of two minutes. Inside of two minutes, so that review came from upstairs. They're just doing their due diligence. That play on the field will stand. It was the right call in the first place. Yeah, it was the right call, but you know what, too? Now it answers the question to the coaches, to all the people watching the game at home and the fans in the stadium. The right call was made on the field. Caught it, but his feet are out of bounds. There's a difference. When you play zone, you drop back and you watch the quarterback and you react to the football. When you're playing man-to-man, -man, all you're worried about is where that receiver goes. You try to shadow him, look for the football, and try to make a play. And he puts it through for three. Nice little recovery that time by the field goal holder. He gets it in position. This kicker, he is a machine right down the middle. The Cowboys are ready to run back this kick. The kick coverage team doing its job, and that's a run back of only 17. Cowboys have been in a fight today. The scores seven to six. Harris lined up now as a slot receiver. First and ten. Murray to the right. A big chunk of yardage gained by DeMarco Murray. Offense lines up again after that jolting 60-yard-plus play. First down and 10. Murray's going to take the handoff now. Gains 20. The Giants use another timeout here, and they have one left. Here's the first snap after the big play. First and goal. They hand it off to, and he's in for the touchdown. That was just an awful job, wasn't it, by the defense? I mean, it's first and goal. Well, you know it's going to be a run, or I think you should be playing run. 
The defense not ready, they get overpowered, and they give up the running touchdown. The Giants prepared to return the kickoff. Always a threat, and he'll start his return now. And the tackle's made. The offense will start their drive from about the 31. The Giants now bring their offense back onto the field for the next drive. Nickel formation for the defense here. Now first and ten. Eyeing that left side. He makes the catch. And the tackle is made right around the 39-yard line. Now the offense in their hurry up. The Giants head to the line. They've got one timeout left here in the fourth quarter. Second down and two. Looking for an open receiver on the right. And he makes the catch just past the first down marker. They're back at the line after that catch for a first down. And Nix is a receiver in the slot. Tight ends in motion here. Second and ten. The quarterback throws to the right. Just couldn't get his feet down on that catch. Not much the offense can do in a situation like this. Third and long, what you probably will have to do is either surprise them with the run or throw it short and hope somebody can make a play and pick up a first down. The Giants will look to get to the 45 to pick up a first down. And Nix is in the slot. Manning's got it in the gun. Scans the field. The offense comes back out here on fourth down. Shotgun look here for Eli Manning. Looks around right where it had to be the tackle was made the Giants with no timeouts left first down following the long play first and ten long ball to Hakeem Nix Good job by the defense. They are all over the throw by the quarterback. They almost pick it off in the end zone. Well, that's a big opportunity missed when you drop a pass like that. At the 31, here we go. The Giants get ready to snap the football. They must be careful. They have no timeouts to play with. Oh, bad decision that time by the quarterback. He tries to force the football into the end zone and it almost gets picked off by the defense one more play and it's in the books third and ten trying to work that left side right on the money a tightly contested contest that has now come to a conclusion This was a close one that came down to the wire. What's that feeling on the sideline right now on the winning side? Oh, it's awesome. When games are close, you're down on the sideline. You look up there every once in a while, and you go, oh, I hope we can find a way to win this game today. They did it. It is truly extremely exciting once you get it done. What an exciting game it was, and let's go to our GMC. Never say never moment of the game.
So for Bill Sims and all the crew at EA Sports, Jim Nance saying so long for now.